Cameron. Uh, I'm going to be talking about my dog, Linus. Uh, we got Linus when he was five weeks old on Halloween. And uh, we got him from our next door neighbors. They have a, uh, a 13 year old pit bull named Zeke and a one year old St. Bernard mix named Button. And they had a litter of eight. He was the smallest one. <coughs> I never wanted a dog, but I saw him, and he was beautiful. So I brought him home. <coughs> uh, the first few nights, he was terrible. <laughs> he had just been weaned the day that we got him, so he was crying all night. Had to let him out about every every hour, and by like by the second night, I was almost in tears from lacking. Um, <clears throat> but he got better with time. Uh, we first taught him how to sit. He learned that right away. Uh, we did that through positive reinforcement, which is <clears throat> instead of demanding that the dog does something, you just wait until they do what you want them to do, and then you reward them. So when he would sit, I would give him a treat, and then eventually he realized that you know, if I sit, I'm going to get rewarded. So <clears throat> then after that, we instilled the uh, like hand gestures, such as this one, which is the sitting. And then the word sit. Um, positive reinforcement is good because, like I said, it rewards good behavior. Um, it's not, not negative. Like some people, if your dogs aren't doing what they want them to do, they'll hit the dog, or if the dog goes to the bathroom in the house, they'll rub their face in it. But the dog really, with that, has no idea what's going on. Because dogs, dogs usually don't remember things from a few minutes ago, so they have no idea why you're rubbing your face in that. <laughs> <laughs> um, <clears throat> so positive reinforcement works because Dogs like treats, they go, and they know if they are doing something correct, they get a treat. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh -oh. so now I'm going to showcase, this is the showcase portion of the treat, where I showcase what I found. <clears throat> talking circles, um, it's because he got excited and did a circle and I instantly gave him a treat. And now he calls it circle. So now he knows it's circle. Okay. And this is my dog, Linus. Thank you.